So the circus continues with this video and the fallout of TJ walking out. TJ in the last video did not know if they were really broken up. Well, he walked out. So what is she talking about when she said she's not clear if they broke up? If she still have a girlfriend? I don't understand, honey. You need to get it together. You broke it up by walking out. So this back and forth that TJ is doing shows that she's very indecisive. And when the pressure is on, TJ runs for the hills, like she did with Naisha. Every minute she's ducking out from Jaguar. Every time Jaguar put the pressure and the squeeze on her and want a confrontation, her pattern is to run. Yeah. No, you didn't. I paid my way. As well, some of those cash apps said TJ and Jag. Wow. Now you're taking credit for that, too. I'm not. No, I didn't contact my daughter, but I'm the op. And the op, honestly, would not be so nice and kind to you if I was the op. This is nice and kind? Betraying me. For no, I just don't like liars. And this is my real life. You get what I'm saying? Like, I never lied on you. Um, and I never lied to this you. This my real life. But you do like liars, because you spent 11 years with Naisha, and that bitch ain't nothing but a Jaguar needs to let it go. Let Laisha go. Let her go. But you and TJ got going on, and have nothing to do with Naisha. You were supposed to make a clean start with TJ and not drag Naisha into it. You never bring old baggage into the new relationship, folks. Remember that. Anytime you leave a man or a woman, you leave them back there and start afresh with the next person. Don't keep bringing them in by talking about them, by texting them, by making phone calls, going on little uh, sneak dates, seeing them somewhere else, talking about you to that person in the down low, in the sneak, in the backyard, in the, you know, like TJ said, she goes outside to talk to Naisha. Now, of course, that's going to create some type of um, suspicion in Jaguar's mind. Those things you don't do when you're starting a new relationship with someone. So TJ, as well as Jaguar, is to be blamed concerning this breakup. Oh, right. so, this is sad. That's all I can do. Because of your lack of integrity and because uh, you don't know how to do. keep your mouth shut. I deserve everything. Um, I deserve everything. You know that I got. It's my promise, so be it. It's nothing from love. Scorpios do lie. Scorpios nothing. lie a lot. Nothing. That's why I stopped nothing. dating them like 20 years um, ago. Yeah. Thank you for the reminder. You know, and you talk about, I still some change. Like I'm, I, I'm she's still talking because about, I said she stole change. And then to not. I never said she stole change. You know, then I asked you, Terry, you played on my daddy's top. And you try to gain empathy, you know, for me. I didn't say hypo. I didn't say hypo. Ma'am, you didn't say hypo. So... It is what it is. No, it isn't. It is what you made it, beloved. This is what you made it. It didn't just happen. You engineered and forced you need to get a real nigga. all of this. She need to get a real she need to get a real nigga. A real what? She really needs to get a real nigga. A real what? A real nigga? You know what a real nigga don't do? Yeah, somebody told me I told you she was lining you up. So lined you up where? Nope. I don't want Messiah. I've never asked for cash Y'all come in and remember, I've never asked for cash I've never. But you have cash gotten cash. some, and I, I wish somebody would cash. ask her in cash app log right now of all the money I sent to her. It's a damn lie. That story, you know, with the Scorpio, what is it, with the snake, with the turtle or something like that, he said, why did you do that? I've been, 
you, you know, I, you did me. Why did you fight me? Did I you taught you that parable, and you can't fight? even repeat it correctly. Please, T.J. Pito said you had. Said that you took the chair, but she did not say that. Okay, she ain't say that. Okay. But you've been saying it for over an hour. Okay, I'm going to move on. Like I said, this will be my last time announcing that and talking about it. It is what it is. I need to figure out what I need to do before it gets too hot on you. You sat there and you slandered me based on lies in a chat for something I never said. This is why I said yeah, you had no I discipline. Had, I did, and you know what? When I did have a hand in, y'all heard my sorrow to King Pay about it. I apologize to him for that. You apologize to King Pay for what? I realized I'm lying to for this shit. <laughs> this I'm glad Jaguar keeps repeating what TJ is saying because it's not very audible. I'm not hearing her very clear, but uh, you know. TJ, I think, is ready to go back based on what she's saying. She just needs an open window. I guess uh, maybe swallow her pride a little bit and crawl right back because she's not clear if they're broken up. And uh, Jaguar, I think, has calmed down in her anger. So I think they're ready to hook up back again and be miserable again. And by next week, TJ will be packing her knapsack again. Bitch is the mother... One that sat there and told me not to trust him. Sean Davy Way from the second that he got here told me all kinds of shit. Now you. You're a liar. And I don't like them liars. Why? I don't know that. You're a liar. And I don't like them liars. You done lied to me so many times. Why do you think I lied to you? Because I thought it was content. Honestly. So I'm wondering how Naisha feels now that they are at odds with each other again. Naisha is probably saying, hmm. I told you so. I told you so, TJ. That woman is no good. But look at me. Look at me receiving all my my stuff from Amazon. And I'm going to get a car from my my viewers. How you like me now? How you like me now? I wasn't even here when Jay got out of jail. Uh, what are you talking about? You're dealing with those, you're wearing my shirt on your hands, and you get the backlash out. Yes, absolutely. And that's why I told you, I'm sorry I'm not Gerald. Like, I'm sorry you didn't come and get you. What are you talking about, bitch? I'm sorry he did not um, he didn't get you. What do you mean you're sorry he didn't come and get me? You've been threatening to put me back in jail every other week when I don't give you your way. I will not be on you anymore. At all. Why not? Tomorrow, the one is fast. Mm. So, but y'all go over there and talk to her and ask her she can send her uh, support. She needs funding. She do have projects that she want to do. Wow. Uh, yeah. After yeah. I spent all the money that I could have spent on my project. She doesn't need that. Taking care of you. You know, now I'm a op. I think it's so funny. Unfortunately, you're, calling me an op. you're, you're acting know, like an op know. right now. You know, my bell. I should have tampered this son. Your mama. I did everything to help you. No, you didn't. I paid my way as well. Some of those cash apps said TJ and Jack. Wow. Now you taking credit for that too. And I'm the op. Y'all didn't contact my daughter. But I'm the op. And the op, honestly, would not be so nice and kind to me if I was the op. This is nice and kind? Betraying me. Because I want it better for you, Jerry. You didn't want better for me. All you did was drive me insane. Well, Jaguar, if you don't want to be driven insane, you need to take your medications. And that will get you on the path of um, 
being a little more sane. But what you're doing to yourself, you can't blame anyone because the medications is what's going to keep Jaguar in some type of normalcy. But this pattern of mania going off the deep edge ever so often is a cycle because she's not taking her meds. In her own words, the last video I just put out, she said she does not take her meds. Not the people who told her the secrets, right? They're not, uh, not the people who kept you from your family. Because if they knew that you were going through what you were going through, they would have told you the truth. Not, not those people, but me. A whole stranger who told nine hours. No, not a stranger. Someone who was working with them when to use me for content. And this video proves it. And what is that? What am I doing? You know what else Sean says? That he's your, your children's father now. And that he's going to adopt your adopted daughter now. That's what Sean says as well. You want to use him as a reference point? So, okay, that makes sense. It is what it is. As a terrorist, you don't even know me, baby niece. You know, you really don't. And you're getting in something you know nothing about. I guess this is how breakups happen in modern society okay this is 2023 and people are breaking up on the internet there's no such thing anymore as okay let's do this behind closed doors we don't want the neighbors to hear what we gotta say all the nastiness all our business on front street we don't want the neighbors to know oh no this is 2023 let's let the whole world know what's going on it's crazy folks <laughs> Please put a one in the chat if I've been sitting here screaming, going mad, losing my mind, and freaking out, and uh, 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 trashing TJ. Please put a one in the chat if that's what I'm doing. Put a two in the chat if I'm handling this betrayal well. What is Jaguar trying to do here? She's trying to... Pull the wool over her eyes. We saw her going crazy in the beginning of the video. And then she calmed down because people were pointing out the fact that she was going ham. She was going chaotic. She was just getting all flustered and unwind. And when she was conscious of that fact, she quieted down. And now she's trying to prove a point that she is quite calm. No, honey. You seething inside. Because this is betrayal. I confirmed that you had dentures. That I, I said. Wow. I, I didn't, didn't even know you had dentures until I heard it. Wow. Okay. Is it you? You're your biggest eye. Not me. Hmm. I should have listened. I should have listened. She spent so much time listening to the chat. She don't know uh, which way is up or down. She don't know whether to fucking wind her butt or scratch her ass. I mean, or scratch her, watch her wind her ass. Like, she's gone right now. I'm, not, I'm tired, y'all. My phone hurt. I'm not sure.
for what? She keep playing on your top. For what? For what? For a change bag? For what? She don't know my story to tell it. She know what was told and what she made up. And what I made up? What did I make up? Mm. Now she's saying I made things up. What did I make up? Somebody go over there and ask her what I made up. I guess I'll, I'll, to, I'll figure it out, please. I'll call my, uh, I'll call my family. So today she has done that when I'm not, I'm just... Oh, no, an idiot. You're an idiot. That's and this live proves it. And then the room doesn't And, uh... Are you serious? Yeah, like, I seen it, I just didn't know, but to believe, yeah, <clears throat> but like, I don't know, I don't, I don't play with people, like, if you don't want to be with somebody, just don't leave it up, like, I don't know, why you got to play a bunch of games, to try to walk them out, make them, make them walk out, like, I don't know, that shit weird to me, but nobody plays games with you, like, nobody plays that, I don't, I don't want to leave it, like, but I'm not about to line you up. Like, you try to lie me up. Uh, I'm not about to do that. You don't want me to do that. You don't want me to do that. You just not with that person. Like, I'm not about to play all these games. I don't have no secrets. Yeah, you do. You have plenty of them. You're a liar. Yeah, you're over there trying to be her. Absolutely not. Yeah, you are. <laughs> I don't want to be her. I'm my own person. And that's the thing. That, that's, I think that's another thing that bothers her, too. But, you know, I digress. You always digress. Why can't you ever finish no, it? She played this respectful game. Like, she played this respect to me and dog me and the public. She has. Yeah, she's playing with you. 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 Guys, as you come on to the channel, please hit that like bell. Subscribe to the channel if you have not done so as yet. Clearly, these two should not be together. They do not respect each other. They think this is a joke. TJ think this is a big joke. It's a game. Anytime she gets upset, she's walking out, packing her little knapsack and going. Jaguar don't want her wrong. Anytime she leaves, Jaguar say don't come back. Well, she always comes back. What well, we're going to see this time if she doubles back and put herself to insults again. But I, it, this is not my place to tell. What's not your place to tell? Uh, it's, it's change is big, it's so free. But they'll talk what the fuck that is. And that's what that's saying about her character. You cried over change? <laughs> I ain't shit. I'm trash. But you and it cried over some change? And I took some change. Is she still talking this change shit? Yeah. Yeah, you are. That's some jam right. Your name is chained to me now. You should just worry about your moral compass stuff. I think all of y'all should. Really. All of y'all. All of y'all. All of y'all. Because I never lied for content. That's the thing. I had it. I didn't do it. This bitch just like said, the breezy with the flow bitch just said, swat Jackie right now to prove that the breakup is real. Not on DJ Genesis out. She won't drag me, that's why I said I will not be getting back on here probably. Why not? You know, she dragged me right now. Let, let's see. How she do it, dog? Um, I, I think I learned a little bit. Uh, somebody texted me talking about they was warning me and they had a guilty conscience. Then somebody texted me as she see a picture. But I don't know how true it is because I realized that you had this the eyes. Jack was really the eye. Jack was really the eye towards me. Because I wasn't doing well. Oh, wow. This is the eye. You want come get your wife? You want come get your wife? Yeah. 
This is disgusting. No, they emailed me and said, and she was like, I don't play no games. Like, so I ignored it. Because I was like, I'm not interested. Like, I'm really not interested. Did you guys listen to what TJ just said? Goomba, come get your wife. Can you imagine? That has always been in the back of her head. Like a lot of people thought that Jaguar still got a crush on or in love with Goomba. Well, apparently TJ thinks the same way. Because she's throwing her right back to her husband. Goomba, come get your wife. And of course, Jaguar is salty because... She don't like to admit that she still have feelings for Goomba. Right, Cat? I thought she was sleepy. Was so she just watching you? Know? Listening to you lie. Now I'm a liar. And you've been a liar. You've been a liar. And you are a thief. Now I'm a liar and a thief. But I'm not about Everything. Jack, what am I about? Well, I know. I'm watching you just like you're watching me. You know? So what am I about? So now I'm a weirdo? Now I'm a weirdo. Yes, yeah, she did, Ayasha. She did tell the about the dentures. Yes, she did. No, I didn't. I when I came in the back, I'm talking to Sean Davey. But... No, I didn't. You're a liar. And then she ruined trees. You're a liar. We it. found yeah. out about it she on trees. Well, Logic is telling me the only person who would know that TJ is wearing dentures are her family and Jaguar. And since the family was not talking and spilling beans, then we look at TJ. Well, TJ is not going to tell her herself. Then we go to Naisha. Ty Naisha might have spilt it, but I doubt if she would spill such sensitive information. So the only person left is Jaguar. And she would know because she is living with TJ, and she would know if she has dentures when she got to pop it out at night and pop it out during the day and pop it out in the morning to get it all brushed up. So obviously the only person that I'm looking at I'm sorry, Jaguar, I got to throw you under the bus, honey. I think you're the one who spilled that tea. Exactly like what TJ is saying, that you're the one who let it out, that she wears dentures. I think she's telling the truth. I'm sorry. You know, I got to call a spade a spade. I think you did it, girl. You done it. You, you, you spilled that tea on TJ. She got it, honey. Not me. Not me. Not me. Well, I, I guess she's a liar because when I sat there and said that I just said in a live we did together that I didn't know until it came out because she never told me. And she sat there and said on AT2, I never take my teeth out. She didn't know. Now she's saying I knew. Well, obviously, she has to take her teeth out at some time to brush it. And I believe maybe it was one of them times that Jaguar sneaked up. You know, she crept up and she peeked through the door to see what TJ was doing. And let me tell you, she probably saw her with the dentures out and could not believe it. She clutched her pearls and said, what? I'm dealing with a toothless. The word begins with a W and end with a E. You guys fill in the blank. I'm dealing with a toothless. You know what? Oh, no, I got to spell this T. This woman coming up in here with teeth, no teeth on the top, and we don't know if she got teeth on the bottom, but toothless. Coming up in here saying that she wants to rub my what? And kiss my what? Oh no, I gotta spill this tea. So, I wonder who she told first. Jaguar, who did you tell first, girl? This is all alleged, but I'm looking at you. I'm, you suspect, because you like to run your mouth, especially with this tintillating and scintillating information, okay? You can't keep your mouth trapped. I know you, Jaguar. Actually, what she did to me when she said about my children today. I said what she said. Yeah, she was like, why don't you tell them what I said? I said what she said about my dead parents today. Yeah, she did. She did. She said what I said. Yeah, she did. She said what I said. What did I say? I tell them. I'm just in my children. It's right at the No, front. tell them. Uh, 
the video. No, tell them. Tell and them sure what was said. Tell them what I said. Absolutely. Stop gaslighting. Tell them what I said. Oh, if they want to spot you, I will, I will not get out the address to spot her. I'm, I'm going to get down like that. Yeah, you would. Yeah, you would. You were all there, Jay. Just you like you were saying really? how you were going to call the jail when and I tell them that the Candace was the threatening your life to, to make sure she didn't know. get out. Well, karaoke, not to me, but thinking karaoke, we were in the room, and then I read all the comments you widows said. No, I'm talking about to her, her, her mod crew. Now people coming over here talking smack in my chat. Uh, Nobody's doing anything for me. I haven't asked anybody to do anything. I told the people that are following you to go ask you questions. I'm a liar and a thief. Like, you are. Don't you say what you said about my children? Why don't you say it? Why don't you say it? You know? That's what we told her. Why don't you say it? <laughs> you always say shit and you never say anything. You're alive. All right. I'm here. Why? TJ, you are both since so you don't have any other thought about yourself. Um, oh, you put on a mod. I realized that. Gypsy soul, you know. And I see you trolling her, but then I see you modding for her. And I realized, like, all you bitches are weird. Everybody's weird to you. Like you said, weird. everybody's a manipulator and weird. you don't trust anyone. Wait, can I smoke ashes? Absolutely not. I'm, I'm a smarter Johnson. <laughs> You're not that smart. You were with Naisha. Obviously. He's with a woman who had a son that was a sexual predator. The only thing he said. That raped both girls in the house. That doesn't make you smarter. See, I know I heard it the first time right. I was questioning if Jaguar meant to say both girls. But she just made it very clear. Naisha's son, S8, both girls in the house. Now, is she talking about TJ's daughters, the one who is a transgender and the adopted girl, or the, the adopted girl and Brie, or was it the adopted girl and one of TJ's daughters? Because Brie said she was never S8. So I'm only presuming that it was baby girl, which is adopted, She's adopted and maybe one of um, Naisha's uh, children, uh, this boy's biological uh, sister. So guys, drop it in the comments. Which two sisters do you think Jaguar was talking about? I know one is baby girl, the youngest uh, child for TJ. But who is the other one? Is it Bree? Because Bree says no, it didn't happen to her. Or is it Naisha's child? Naisha's daughter. What it is. Yeah, I do. I know you're a liar. She know what it is. Yes, you're a liar. But you want to talk about people with children. Go ahead, talk about me. You can't handle people making videos and all that stuff about your children. I can't handle it? You're disrespectful, Jacqueline. Now so I'm disrespectful, Jacqueline? <laughs> A Scorpio and a fucking Taurus. We can be good or we can be bad. Which way? No, you're bad. Period. You've been nothing but bad. You brought nothing but bad into my life. I'm gone. I'm, 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 I'm gone. I just asked. But I'm cool with Essie Terry did not lie on me. It's cool. And I'm cool with you lying on me too. It's cool. If this won't bring you some bad funding, because you do have to leave tomorrow. Wow. Cool. You do need to work on your album. You do have things and projects that you need to get done. Did, did you hear her just take the dig at the fact that where we're staying is in her name? You literally said And something. she's refusing to give me the landlord's yeah, number yeah, so that I can make arrangements to stay. I do. Don't come back. Jaguar, stop being so dependent. You got money? Go to another hotel. You don't have to be in that Airbnb. Go to a hotel. If DJ don't want to give you any number to the landlord, pull up your big girl panties. Stop being so damn dependent. 
That's what got you in this boat. You depended on TJ to do everything. That's why you don't know the number to the landlord because you wanted her to take care of everything. So guess what? You're in a pickle because you put yourself in it. Up a creek without a boat. Between a rock and a hard place. Don't know the forest from the trees. And you guys can drop whatever else. The saying is, when people put themselves in this type of predicament, drop your comments in the comment section. Don't forget to hit the like bell and subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed as yet. I don't have to come back. I don't want to come back. That's why I've been outside for 12 hours. I don't want to. Sasha. No, you've been outside for 12 hours because you're in trouble. Because you know you got caught and you're running. Like you always do, TJ, when you get caught lying. Ayasha, don't, don't get, don't get cute. Please don't. Ayasha, you don't. I love Jag, bitch. I don't love you. And there's a big damn difference. So don't get cute. Please don't get cute. I'll be weird. You already weird, bitch. <laughs> You already weird. Uh, uh, she said, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. trouble. <laughs> uh, uh. This is very immature on. TJ's part. She walks out. Then she says, I don't know if I'm really broken up with Jaguar. Then she's going to stay on her phone doing a live and laughing and jeering and making fun of and poking fun at. Very immature. Instead of her calling Jaguar off of the live privately and having a private big girl conversation. No, not her. She's very immature in that sense. Oh, I'm going to, oh, I'm reading her chat too. The fact that I went live, I went live after she went live on her Instagram. I'm talking about I'm jealous. Jealous of what? So TJ said she went live because Jaguar went live. But guess what? Two wrongs don't make a right. And you're old enough to do better. If you know better, you do better. Not because she got on the live to drag you through the mud means you're going to do the same thing to her. Who, who do you have for me to be jealous of? It's just been me, you, and your... Uh-uh, clean up outside. It's not TJ got to speak. Now I'm sorry, TJ got to speak. Uh, you should yeah. figure out what you're going And now you get to hear how stupid she is. Is it? Widow, one ass bitch, why not? I got an email. Somebody really did send me an email. I wonder if it's you. I'm really curious if it's you because this person lost their kids, bitch. Is it you? You want to know what's interesting? You? With your lying ass. Everybody's a liar except for her. Is it? Everybody's out to get her. She didn't do nothing wrong, even though she deleted evidence and phone and calls really and pictures. Guess what I would do? Because the way I feel right now, if I went out wrong, I, I, I really would tell you this thing. Yeah, that's what I would do. I would tell you this thing. And I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to the so I cut the video short if you guys want to go check it out over there. I have come to the conclusion that misery indeed loves company. Jaguar and TJ are very unhappy people. And they are choosing to be with each other to kind of demolish each other. You know, when you're unhappy and you got to cut somebody out, what better? situation you're in than to have the person right there. You don't have to go looking. The person is right there laying next to you. So you roll over in the morning cussing. You ready.
because you got somebody, a whipping boy, right next to you, or a whipping girl, or a whipping woman, right next to you that you can cuss out. That's what's going on here. They love the dysfunction. There is no, oh, well, meet me in the middle. There's no meeting in the middle. These two love the situation the way it, the way it is, because in closing, in this video, we hear where TJ said she don't know if she's broken up or not. And so, my conclusion is these two are going to get back together. Only to break up again, many times over and over again, until somebody has had it and said, you can't come back here or I'm not coming back here. That's my conclusion. Drop yours in the comments. I'm over and out. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching.